Loving this new lens as well. Look at this. I love this like depth of field that I get. Just got showered and changed. We're off to go zip lining right now, so I'm gonna go upstairs, put my shoes on, hop in the car, and we'll go to zip lining. This should be pretty great. Let's go. Okay guys, so we ended up not going to uh, to go zip lining because it was full. I know you guys would have seen that um, because we didn't actually, you didn't see any footage of the zip lining. A little bit unfortunate, but um, you know, what can you do? So um, just got home, Germany's playing France right now. It's currently one nil to France. Um, I'm try I wanna try and work on making these vlogs a little bit longer because I feel like over the last couple of days, being here, they're a little bit short, but just came, something just came in the mail for me today that's gonna make these vlogs a hundred times better. Check it out. So this is what came in the mail. Let's open this. A brand new lens, 10 to 18 millimeters, much better for vlogging, way, way better, um, I've been told. So, let's give this a little open. Some information, don't need that. sexy here's the lens itself it looks pretty small let's uh let's see what it looks like on the camera so this is it with the new lens on i don't know how big of a difference you guys can tell that makes but um for me i can see the huge difference there's so much more in the uh in the frame now like it gives a little bit of context to the frame so like this is the wide this is the widest angle this is it zoomed in so this is really nice i really like this a lot more but a lot better for vlogging and uh just overall looks pretty fucking dope not gonna lie anyway gonna go watch a germany game then gonna come back get ready when going out to dinner so let's watch a germany game see you in a little bit um game just finished germany ended up losing 2-0 which is a bit of a surprise they didn't play a very good game to be honest um normally the germany team you have full confidence in that can win but i mean that's how football goes sometimes anyway got to edit this video real quick then we're heading out to dinner so yeah i don't know what we're going to be doing after that but we'll see we'll see we'll see anyway um edit this video real fast i just want to talk about something that's really bugged me with the vlog i just uploaded and that is the length it really just pissed me off so far, I've really, really enjoyed making these videos. I think they're great. I love filming them. I love editing them. I love uploading them. I love seeing the interaction I get with you guys. But something that's really let, let me down over the last couple of days with my travel vlog and the vlog yesterday from the 4th is it's so fucking short. And it really pisses me off because I can, it, it takes no effort to pick up the camera and to shoot things. And I don't know why I do it, especially when I'm out in public. The thing is, I get so nervous of what people think, and I really need to get out of that mindset. It's really not good because who cares what people think? You know what I mean? Like, people, people will judge you no matter what you do. And if we're all part of the crowd, if everyone was the same, the human race would be stupid, it would be dumb, and it would be over already. We need people who are different and, and are willing to take risks. And anyone that judges you, is one, insecure about themselves, or two, jealous of you. Anyway, that's really it. That's all I wanted to say. You know, I'm like, loving this new lens as well. Look at this, I love this like depth of field that I get. But um, that's, that's what I wanted to say. I'm really gonna work hard on making these vlogs longer because I know I wanna make them longer. Like personally, I really wanna make them longer and I want you guys to enjoy them. And, and I don't want this to become something that's like, oh, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. I want it to be seven, eight, nine minutes long. Try and make them as good and as long as possible because that's what I really, really, really want. Anyway, just what was on my mind. That's out of the way. Just thought it felt like I had to say something about it. 
We're going out to dinner here pretty soon. Oh, if I can open this door. Jesus, that was hard. Um. Okay. So yeah, like I said, going out to dinner here pretty soon. Um, going to the Outback Steakhouse. Love that place. Absolutely love it. Fucking food is so good. So, so, so good. And on a completely unrelated note, there's something I really, really want to talk about, and this is a little bit deep. This is what I want to talk about. I don't know how much you guys have heard, especially if you haven't been in the US or you don't follow the news, but um, over the last, uh, I want to say 24, 48 hours, two black people in the south of the United States have been killed. Um, now obviously there's a lot of speculation as to you know the circumstances and things like that but from the research I've done um, and from the information I've gathered both of the men were unarmed. One of them was an, a licensed um, handgun carrier and he notified the police when he'd been pulled over by the police that he was a notified handgun um, owner and he was armed. The police officer then armed um, asked him to uh, give his license and registration. So he reached over to the glove box to pull out his license and registration. And as he was reaching, the police officer shot him four times. Not once in the leg, not twice, not three times, like anywhere that couldn't have killed him four times in the torso. That's unbelievable. And the reason I wanna talk about this is because I feel like it's wrong for me not to talk about it because those two people lost their lives as the facts look, because they were black, not because of wrongdoings. And a country where I'm currently am residing right now, and a country I am a citizen to, this is a big problem. This has been going on for a long, long time. And uh, the government's not doing anything about it. And no, I'm not saying that's the government's fault, because I know how difficult it is to try and legislate guns, especially in a country like this, where people like their guns. And I don't want to offend anyone if, if you're a police officer or you like guns, it's not meant to do that. The thing is, when things like that happen and things like the Orlando shootings and Sandy Hook, when all those things sort of happen, you gotta do something in order to try and stop it, otherwise it's just gonna keep happening. And I didn't, I don't wanna, I don't wanna bring up any controversial topics, I don't wanna talk about anything like that, because I, I know, or politics, because I know it'll just offend people. But I felt it was really important for me, myself, to talk about this, to one, raise awareness, and two, to sort of give my viewpoint on it. And um, in terms of as, a, as a, in terms of uh, a solution, I really don't know what to say. Like, I can't give you one. I'm not, I'm not smart enough uh, or anything like that to give you a solution, but I really think it's something that needs to be, that, that, that really needs to be addressed because if things keep going the way they are, I don't know what to say. And if you find yourselves in one of those situations with the police or what have you, if the police, one of the major arguments uh, was that the man who was shot wasn't complying with the police. If you find yourselves in one of those situations, because guys, please, 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 just listen to the police officer, do as he says, and make sure you just stay out of trouble. I don't want anything to happen to anyone. I don't want any more innocent lives lost. Anyway, you guys know I don't like too much negativity in this vlog at all, so I'm going to uh, move away from the negativity, move on to some positivity, and um, yeah, so I uh, hope you're all having a wonderful day. hope you all have smiled at least once today. Um, anyway, I'm ready to get some food. Fucking hell, I've been saying that we we're going to get food for ages, so finally, let's go get some food. Please. Anyway guys, I'm going to close the vlog out here. Really enjoyed today's vlog. 
dope new lens. Hope you guys enjoy it as much as I do. Um, make sure you guys uh, stay positive, stay happy. Make sure you have a great day today or any day you're watching this. Make sure you go out and do something nice for somebody else. We all have enough negativity in our lives. We could all do with a little bit of positivity. Anyway guys, this has been Will and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.